All right, our Foodie Friday guests this week are kind of a big <laughs> dill. Ba -dum -bum. Long Island Seven Brothers Gourmet Food Market started scooping out pickles and using them as buns for sandwiches. So let's just say folks are eating them up. And after a post from Gabby Parmesan on TikTok, it racked up millions of views. Pickle mania ensued with fans driving from miles away just for a bite. Pickle mania indeed. And well, this morning we're finding out more about them and of course giving them a try. Joining us are Anthony Fiorito, owner of Seven Brothers, Victor Padilla, and Sandro Fiorito. Welcome to Pix 11. Thank you Hi so much for having us. Thank, Thank you for having us here. And here they are the right here. These are the sandwiches that are now huge. Have to know who came up with them and how long have they been out? So back in January, I have two longtime cashiers that have been with us for a very long time, and they were in the mood for something different. So they wanted to have a pickled sandwich, so they asked one of the deli guys to make the sandwich for them. So we made it. And fast forward to the summertime, I had one of my summertime cashiers come back, and her sister was a pickle lover, and that was Gabby. Gabby posted a video of it, and after that, it just exploded. Wow, so at the time, you were already selling it? Yeah, at the time, we were already selling it. Not too many, though. But after she put that video up, it went from like 10, 10 a day, 20 a day, 30 a day. Then we started going through pails. Yeah. I mean, this is the, what's crazy. It has become so popular. You had to release like a PSA announcement. This is what it says. We want to welcome all our new customers to Seven Brothers, but we also want to consider our customers who become family over the years. So in doing so, to resolve the long lines, we've created a pickle sandwich line and a deli line. So thank you for your patience during this new and exciting time for us. I mean, it's that big that you need to have a separate yes. line? Yes. So this really blew up on Juneteenth, I guess, because that was like the first big holiday for yeah. everybody that people were off. And there was a line literally out the door. So oh then come for the weekend, there was an extremely long line. We saw people walking off at a the, the deli counter, so we said that we needed to create two separate lines. Well, this guy has not been able to keep himself still in that seat over there in the anchor desk because he's wanted to try this so bad. So go ahead, Justin. I, I'm going to, Partake. of course, you know. Uh, like me to cut in well, here for you? Yeah, it's good now. Oh, come on. Oh, Be okay. me. All right, oh, okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, all right. So while he, does, while he takes a taste here, mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about Seven Brothers Gourmet. So we've been in business for over 50 years. My dad started it back in 1972, and, uh, yeah, we've been in Queens for about 30 years, and then we moved to Long Island about 20 years ago. Wow. And this is the, my dad's one of 13. This is the youngest brother right here. Oh, wow. This is uh, Uncle Sandro. Oh, how so tell, tell us a little bit about how the business has grown over the it, years. It grew very, very big. Very fast. Yeah, yeah very, very fast. fast. Yes. Yeah, so it's, it's, I mean, you brought some, along some other sandwiches as well, because that's, you're not just known for the pickles. No, we have a bunch of other stuff too. We make homemade fresh mozzarella daily, so we brought that over here. We have marinated skirt steak, peppers oregano, broccoli rabe, orzo pasta salad. Everybody loves our Captain Crunch chicken fingers. And then over here you got fried pickle spears and you have chips too. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to try it. Okay, fried so I've, I've wrapped up spear. Judge's Table on and? the pickle bun sandwich. You know, I like it. No? Um, I like there the is something pickle. about the um, the pickle being kind of tart. Yeah. With the, with the turkey and the, the cheese and the bacon. If you like pickles, you'll love it. And if you don't like pickles, I think you'll jump on. And I was going to say something. The best thing with that pickle, too, is the honey mustard. Oh! I got the, the sauces involved. Okay, yes. here we go. <laughs> you know what's so great about it, too? Yeah, it's you. like you have the sourness of the pickle. Mm -hmm. You got the saltiness of the bacon, the sweetness of the honey turkey. Why don't you show us how you make one? Sure. My pleasure. Oh, hey. Quick. What? Mm -hmm. OK. So you cut off both ends just a little bit. Okay. Just to give it that meat look. And Slice again, you, you probably sell about how many of these a day? About 500 a day now. 500 a day? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Yeah, you use it's all been your intense. pickles that come in each day? Absolutely. Yeah, pretty wow. much. Yes. We used no to order ways. one pail a week, we now we're ordering about, about 70 pails a week. Yeah. You used to only buy one pail a week. Yeah, and now, now we're getting like 70. 70 pails of pickles. So you, then you scoop it out. Scoop it out. I think Dan Manarino would like this. He likes to scoop out his bagels. Maybe he's going to start he's scooping out his pickles. <laughs> okay, so you scoop out the pickle. Yeah. What do you do with all the extra stuff? That's what we make the fried pickle spears oh, with. Oh, that's what oh. you do. Oh. Yeah. Well, there's nothing wasted. And you know Zero what's waste. so great, too? Like, think about the artichoke. The artichoke heart is the best part. Yes. The inside of the yes. pickle is the best oh part, gosh, too. That, it's like the heart. That is brilliant. That is so brilliant. I get everything okay, off, so and then I'll put the honey turkey 
got the provolone, you got the bacon, and then the lettuce. Wow, that's brilliant. Genius, genius. And you got that special flip. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. And tell the folks at home where we can find you guys again. Um, in Oceanside, Long Island, Seven Brothers Gourmet Food Market. Wow, ta-da, that's delicious. Your pickle people must love you. I mean, oh yeah. <laughs> I, never remind, knew, I never knew how many pickle lovers there were. <laughs> and remind folks about the line then when they get there. Yeah, they have their separate pickle line that they just line up for, and that's pretty much that. Yeah. Wow. Well, thanks for coming in. And yeah. Thank you so much for having us. Having us. Thank you. He's having been us. mouth watering over I, I there at the I've desk been, for so long. I have to admit, of course, and I've been pleased. This is great. All right, you can check out these pickle bun sandwiches at Seven Brothers Gourmet Food in Oceanside, New York. Don't forget that.